Okay, I promised I'd show how to build the slaughterhouse, so here it is. It's actually extremely simple. It might look complicated all put together, but it's actually just one very easy to build machine repeated over and over. Alright, you start off with a 5x3 platform. You can use whatever material you want. I'm just going to use wool here for demonstration purposes. And you put a little 1x2 chip at the end. That's the end the dispensers are going to go on, the direction the apparatus is going to fire. And then you place your dispensers like so. Now this middle wool block is essential, it's not just for support, it's actually going to be conducting the current to all three dispensers at once, so leave it in there. Then on the back side, two spaces away from the dispensers, you place your rap fi rapid fire redstone clock. Now I have no idea how this thing works, I just know how to build it. I'm not a redstone expert at all. Now this clock will continue to pulse after you make it until you apply a current to it. So just place a lever and turn it on and it locks up the clock. Turn it off and it releases it again. Then you just attach the clock to the dispensers. Let me just fill this thing with some ammo so you can see it in action. Now here's the weird part. This setup right here, on its own, doesn't actually work. It doesn't fire rapid, it just fires sporadically for some reason. I don't know. But I do know how to fix it. If you apply another current to the conductor block, it somehow regulates the pulses and allows the machine to fire rapid. If you guys know why this works, just tell me in the comments. I'm curious. So here's a view of the circuit from above. Okay, so now I've cloned that device five times using MC Edit and set them all side by side. You can see that they fit together like a puzzle. Now because all of these clocks are touching each other, you can just put one redstone torch at the end of the middle device and it'll lock them all up. Now all you have to do is link this redstone torch to your fire control system. And it's very easy to set up. All you need is a positive current going into the block below the redstone torch. Then it'll invert that redstone torch and release the clocks. And if you want to do it like I did and put the fire control system on the wall above the slaughterhouse, you just uh, build a steps of redstone up to the top. Like so. Now you don't have to do it exactly like this, I'm sure this isn't the most efficient way to do it. It's just how I threw it together. You just use repeaters of course to repeat the current when it reaches its terminus. Then you place your fire control node and put whatever controls you want on it. And then you just clone this whole meta device in MC Edit and rotate it around so that it's facing all, all four directions. And add your walls to the dispensers down below or whatever you want. And now because it was suggested on Reddit, I have filled the dispensers of a slaughterhouse with different ammo. Along with the arrows, I've added eggs. So when it's fired, it spawns chickens and kills them at the same time. Anyway, that's how you build it. If you enjoyed it, subscribe. Please rate the video, blah blah blah. See you guys later. Bye bye.